Welcome to Eduform YouTube channel. Today we are going to discuss pharmacognosy. It is the second lecture of drug containing glycosides. Today's lecture is about cardiac glycosides. The glycan part of the cardiac glycosides is steroidal in structure. Now what that means? That means that they have a basic steroidal moiety. Every type of molecules which are steroid in structure like cholesterol, certain type of vitamins, testosterone, estrogen, etc. hormones, they all are steroid and they all are derivative of this following link system. Now cardiac glycosides, the glycan part of the cardiac glycoside is also derivative of this following link system. There are three six-membered ring and one five-membered ring. The numbering of the ring system is as follows. It is the carbon number one and then ring A and B numbered first from one to ten. Then we should number that ring C and D starting with carbon 11. And lastly, the two methyl groups numbered as 18 and 19. Now this carbon number 17 is an important position for steroid structure. Substitution basically occurs in C17 and based on the substitution, based on the structure of the substitution, there are various types of steroids available in nature. Glycosides have two parts, one is glycon and one is aglycon part. In case of cardiac glycosides, the aglycon part is steroid in nature and the glycon part or sugar part attached with the C3 position of that steroid ring. Now based on the structure of the substitution at C17 position, cardiac glycosides classified as two types. First is cardinolite and another is bufodinolite. Now let's check the structure of cardinolite and bufodinolite. In case of cardinolites at C17 position there is 5 membered lactone ring and in case of bufodinolites at C17 position of steroid nucleus there is a substitution of 6 membered lactone ring. It is the, the only difference between cardinolite and bufodinolite structure. So in case of cardinolites there is one double bond and in case of bufodinolites there are two double bonds. In both of the structure the R at C3 position represent the glycon or sugar part. The example of cardinolites are digitalis, thibesia, stopranthes and auavin and the example of bufodinolite are indian school and european school. Some important points to remember. The lactone ring is essential for the cardiac activity. The therapeutic activity of cardiac glycoside is dependent upon the lactone rings at C17 position. The congestive heart failure or CHF may be treated by cardiac glycosides. The cardiac glycosides act as cardiotonic drug and increases the force of systolic contractions. Thanks for your support. Please like and subscribe our channel for further updates.